Photographers, if you're shooting an automatic, you need to make that switch to manual. I'll explain how to use it right now. First, let's talk about aperture. Aperture controls the amount of light coming through your lens and onto your sensor. If you're taking portraits and you want that nice blurry background, you want to open that lens up wide and bring that number lower. If you're taking landscapes and you want everything in focus, you want to bring up your aperture. Next, let's talk about shutter speed. Shutter speed determines the length of time your sensor is exposed to light. When you see those photos of silky smooth waterfalls or light trails like this, that is done with a very slow shutter speed, bringing that number down. If you're taking portraits and your subject is moving too much and you don't want any motion blur, then you need to bring that shutter speed higher, making it faster. I like to think of ISO as fake light. The higher you bring that number, the brighter your shot gets, the lower the darker. The one downside to exposing with ISO is that you'll introduce noise.